In what feels like an eternity ago, Aaron Judge was offered a seven-year, $213.5 million contract by the New York Yankees. He swiftly declined this contract and decided to bet on himself going into the 2022 season. In order to keep myself from blowing a lid, let's just say it's obvious that it paid off for him. And real quick, I never do this, but if you like this content and don't mind subscribing, that would be fantastic. It is free, you won't break the bank. And since people ask me to do longer videos than I am, the algorithm takes time to catch up because it's a pain in the ass. Whatever, let's get into the video. And at what seems to be common Brian Cashman territory, he pissed off the team's superstar. He did the exact same thing with Derek Jeter, however the situation was different. In Jeter's case, the Yankees' brain trust Cashman decided that he would threaten Jeter by saying, I will sign Troy Tulowitzki. Well, we all know how that worked out. Tulo ended up coming to the Yankees later in his career, played about four games, and disappeared. With Aaron Judge... In my personal opinion, as soon as Brian Cashman decided that he was going to hold a press conference and release all that information about the contract, Judge's mindset went from, I'm going to bet on myself to see how much more the Yankees will offer me, to I'm going to bet on myself to see which team wants me the most. Let's start with the Boston Red Sox. Reportedly, Raphael Devers is looking for a $300 million contract, and being that he is their homegrown talent, if Devers re-signs with the Red Sox, I personally think they're out of the judge running. However, the real threat to Aaron Judge is the San Francisco Giants, where he grew up and the team that he was rooting for. It will come down to whether or not the Yankees are willing to match or better the offer from San Francisco. My confidence in Cashman could not be lower on that one. And keeping in mind that the Dodgers, the Mets, possibly the Twins, there's going to be teams out there with offers for Aaron Judge. He's going to be able to go anywhere he wants, being that the offer is right. The Yankee fan in me is screaming that this better get done. Matter of fact, I made a video the other day screaming that this better get done. But the realistic baseball side of me says that Aaron Judge is going to be 31 in April. Keeping in mind, Mike Trout is going to be 32 in August. Time flies. Regardless, the old Yankee Stadium was the house that Ruth built. The new Yankee Stadium is the house the Yankees built Judge into due to the chambers. It will look really, really bad, even though it doesn't seem to matter to Hal Steinbrenner because Cashman's his little puppy. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. You see? See how quickly I can turn a video into a rant? Anyways, Aaron Judge will either be a Yankee or a Giant. That much I am confident enough to say out loud. And football will be returning to this channel very soon.